everybody welcome back to my channel how you guys doing on the other side i am doing great on this side and today is vlogmas 13. i'm so excited today's vlogmas 13. um i'm excited that i made it to vlogmas 13. and today is happy sunday what a grateful grateful day this is the day that the lord has made and i will rejoice and be glad in it everybody so today i don't have too much on the agenda i'm just solo dolo today my kids didn't want to ride with me so they're at home doing their own little thing and i can respect that you feels me so today i might just be like I said, I'm so low dolo today, so I'm gonna go by my mama house, and then I might go by me. I might go by McDonald's and get me a frappe, and then go by my mother's house and probably go to a couple of stores just to try to find a couple of things for the boys. But like I said in a previous video, it's kind of hard going shopping for boys, teenager boys, so. I'm going to try to hurry up and um, close that up. You know, try to get them a couple of more presents because Simone, she got more presents than them. She, she got more presents than them. And it's because it's hard to find... It's, it's hard. It's hard to find boy stuff. Not when they're little, but when they're teenagers. I find it hard as they get older. And I hope y'all guys can see me. My lighting. Well, this is natural light out here in the world. But yeah, so um, it's kind of hard trying to um, find boys the right gift. The right gifts because they so picky and especially my boys they all into the um playstation 4 we got two playstation 4s in the house i know i probably mentioned it before um the four in the regular four and the four pro but i was trying to get them the playstation 5 but i don't i can't find it nowhere so hopefully next year i'll probably get it for them but i'm gonna make them work for that so um yeah so basically then i already got them shoes so i don't i'm not buying no more shoes because i already brought them some shoes for their birthday their birthday was november the 16th i'm not buying no more shoes because they already got shoes and they got another pair of new shoes then simone she already got shoes then um dooney he got new shoes that he ain't even not wore yet so that i have bought so i'm not buying shoes so it is what it is. So I'm gonna have to go through. I'm gonna have to go to the stores. Then they already got phones. Everybody got a phone. I'm not upgrading. Sorry, not this year. I'm not upgrading no iPhone. So I'm not even upgrading mine. Mine gonna stay the same. I'm gonna continue. We gonna continue to use these phones to save money until they just tap out. And when they tap out, that's when we all get a new phone. So um yeah. So I got um. Uh, try to go to the stores today on this good Sunday and try to find some stuff like my boys they are mainly into hoodies um clothes stuff like that so I might just try to find them something I know they need a couple of new things but I ain't gonna say it because I know they be looking at my um my videos and then they'll know what I've been done brought them for Christmas so I gotta keep that part on a hush hush but um yeah I look kind of dark, y'all, when I'm back like this. But when I come up, y'all can see me. But yeah, y'all, so I'm going to get back on here when I make it to my mom's house. Or if I don't, I'll um, bring you guys along with me while I go to the stores and look at different things. But like I said, I'm not going to record what I put in the buggy. I'm just going to take you there with me. And if I see something that I like for them that I know that they'll like, I'll get it for them. But if I don't, I won't get nothing. I don't know. Like, next year, if the Lord bless us, if it's in his willing, 
to let us see a next year and Christmas and stuff like that. I think I'm thinking about just really just probably doing trips, going on trips with my family. Maybe that'll be better. Like do a vacation with big kids because they basically pretty much got really a lot of stuff that they want. They really got basically everything. So to me, they do. And they don't really ask for much. But, you know, the stuff that they do ask for, I try to get it for them by the grace of God. But um, I think we're going to probably try to start doing um, trips, going on vacations for um, the holidays. That'd be a Christmas present and just put some money on a gift card. Probably like 150, probably up to 250 a piece, and I think that'll be that'll be a good present for them. But yeah, y'all. I mean, it was so easy when they was younger. Like you could just go in the store because all my kids they always had a favorite um, toy, like a favorite um, character of a cartoon or whatever my my oldest daughter her favorite was powerpuff girls and um the teletubbies the um baby girl hers were dora she liked the dora oh my oldest girl she liked the brat dolls too so the baby she liked the lulu lucy la la loopsy i don't remember I don't remember how the name was, but I think it was La La Lucy or something. Her hair used to be weird. You can shape and form it to a certain way, y'all. But, um, yeah, she liked it La La Lucy as she got older. But her young, when she was young, she liked it um, Dora, Dora the Explorer. So I had got her the whole Dora Explorer um, top of the bed, the Dora Explorer table where she eat at with the chairs, the Dora, Dora Explorer... Um, little stand for the um the storage for the um toys so i just dora explored her overboard i overboard her. i went overboard with the dora explorer and so my son my oldest son dooning he was crazy about bob the builder he was crazy about bob the builder and um buzz lightyear and woody the, the um store tory this why i can't talk y'all the um what it is it? Toy Story. Yeah. So they was fascinated about those characters. Now, the twins, hmm, one was, I think it was Cortez. Cortez was fascinated by Spider-Man. And Justin was fascinated by um, Batman. So all that stuff was easy. Like, and then learning toys, tablets, you know what I'm saying? As they was growing up when they was younger. That stuff was easy to get, you know what I'm saying? So, I enjoyed doing Christmas shopping more when they was younger. Because you can get a lot. Like Then they went to the phase when they got bikes. Then a couple more years and they got new bikes. Skates. Um, pools. Trampolines. This is when I used to stay in the house. Um, what else? Jump ropes. Hula hoops. You know, little stuff like that for Christmas, but now, honey, I don't know what to get, though. I might need to upgrade. It's probably time to get start getting them some cars or something for their birthdays and Christmas and taking them on trips because it's, it's just hard. It's really... And then when they do tell you what they want for Christmas, being though that they older, it's expensive. <laughs> it's expensive. Is, is, is expensive so yep so like I said the comment below if anybody feel the way I feel or they have experience when they children was younger was it easier to get their presents when they was younger or was it easier to get their presents as they grew older and me personally I feel like it was easier for me to get my children presents as they got um, as they when they was younger so yeah so, you guys, I'm going to come back on here and take y'all along with me to the stores that I go to. I might ask my mama to come with me because I'm so low dolo today. But I want somebody to be with me today. Shoo. But, all right, y'all. I'll be back. Hey, y'all. I am back. 
so I am in a drive through of Captain D's. I need some help, y'all. I need I need some help to start eating out. Like I need to make this my official last day of eating out, cause this is just ridiculous. Cause it just it just become unhealthy if you just keep eating out back to back. But um, I haven't made it to the stores yet. I actually had to make a stop right quick to a friend of my house. So now I'm in Captain D's for to get me something to eat. Even though I had fish the other day, but I had a taste for more fish today. And yeah. But um I need to do something about this because I'm picking up a little bit too much weight. Well, which I really didn't eat nothing all day today, but I did get some of the roast that I had cooked yesterday. And so, yeah. I just had got like a little bit of the potatoes and a little bit of meat. That was just earlier today, around about 12. So, now it's dinner time. So, I don't think it should affect me that much. Hopefully, it should since but I do need to lay off these restaurants for a little bit, though. So yeah, I'm gonna get this fish sandwich and fries and a drink and I also ordered me a cheesecake. Mm -mm -mm. Mm -mm. Thank you. But yeah, y'all, I ain't doing too much today. But I'm gonna see, I'll probably go to Ross. No, i probably go to Marshall's. Thank you, ma'am. Mm -hmm. Can I have hot sauce and um, extra tartar sauce in the bag and ketchup? Mm -hmm. Thank you. Thank you, ma'am. So, yeah, then I still gotta go to my mama's house. I asked my mom, did she wanna come out with me? She told me she ain't wanna come out. She just relaxing on this Sunday. I said, okay. Well, all right. So, this is my sweet tea, y'all. I should've asked for some lemon. Yeah, I'll be ordering my drinks and my teas and stuff with a lot of ice. Okay, look how the um strawberry sauce look. And this is the cheesecake. Okay, the cheesecake already be packaged. Can y'all see it? Mm, that cheesecake look like it's gonna be some yummy, yummy, yum. Some yummy, yummy, yum good. My children are gonna see this too. They're gonna be like, Mom. <clears throat> Cause yesterday I had went out to eat with some mom. We had their pizza in the car, but they don't never be one to come. Like every time I get ready to go out the door, they be like, uh-uh. Cause they be either playing the game, watching movies. Cause you know it really ain't too much to do. We still in a, a, a pandemic. So and they be like, Mom, I don't wanna catch corona, or whatever, whatever. And I'm like, Y'all not gonna catch corona because y'all covered by the blood of Jesus. And if it was a case scenario that, you know, he allowed that to happen, we still believe that he we won't die from it. You know what I'm saying? We going to live. We will be healed. But we, we believe in and we praying that we never catch corona. But they be all into their own little world in the house. All tucked off and comfortable and stuff. So, what did they? Oh, did my lettuce. I told them put my lettuce. I like when, um... for my um stuff to go on my burger or chicken sandwich or fish sandwich any kind of um condiments i like for it to be on the side i don't like for it to be on my sandwich 
because by the time I get my sandwich and by the time I get ready to eat it or bite through it, it be like, it be soggy or something. So I like to put my own condiments and stuff on my um, sandwiches when I order it. Except um, Subway, because I'm standing right there in front of them. And, but when you're going through a drive through I can't see you, what you're doing. So I will rather prefer for me to put my own condiments on my stuff. And it goes, yeah. Sometimes the tomatoes don't be good. You know what I'm talking about? Or the lettuce, and I can look at it myself, see if I want to apply that to my sandwich. But yeah. So yeah, they are gonna be like, you done did it again. But I just feel like this, you don't get in the car. You know, sometimes I eat out when I come out, get little snacks and stuff, do little things, you know what I'm saying? Cause it be that moment, I be in that moment. And sometimes I don't. And so Simone, she was asleep. So when I left, she was asleep because she went to bed. I think Simone went to bed right about 5, 6 o'clock that morning. Because she was up. I know she cleaned up the kitchen. And then um, she was up on her little... um. Ooh, look at this sandwich, y'all. Look at this sandwich. What I'm gonna do with all this food? Can y'all see? My mouth watering. This a big old sandwich, baby. But they got food at the house. I did cook the roast and stuff, and, and mom, she cooked rice last night. Mmm. Look good. That fish nice and hot. So I'ma um put some tartar sauce on my fish. And put some hot sauce on there. I don't think I'm gonna do the lettuce. They gave me some lettuce, but I don't think I'm gonna do it. Ma'am, I'm not doing the lettuce today, ma'am. And I might as well stop at my mama house first. See what she got going on. And then go to the stores. But y'all, I'm going to see y'all when I get to the stores at either my mama house. Now, if I go to the store, because I know how I am after I've been there eight. I've been done got lazy and got tired, but I'm gonna try to make it out there today though. But I'm gonna um be back on here in a few. Put this tartar sauce on my um fish sandwich. It seems like every time you be doing something and you get at a stop sign, there go folks that be wanting to come behind you. But when you ain't got nothing to do and you at a stop sign, don't nobody be behind you. Hmm. Trying to hear you put my stuff on my sandwich so I can uh ride. You feed me. I hope the lady. Put my hot sauce in here. I asked her for hot sauce. Where my hot sauce at, Lordy? Y'all, I'm at a stop sign. Ain't nobody behind me. Okay, dig on my um. I'm trying to hurry up and dress my um, which I could pull over, but at least I'm not doing it while I'm driving. But I am at a stop sign trying to dress my sandwich. So, I got my sandwich dressed with the stuff that I want on there. And I'm going to see you guys later when I get in the store. So, you guys, I finally made it to Marshall's. And so, I'm just going to browse in here and see if I can find the boys a couple of more things for Christmas. And, yeah. 
So that's what I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna be looking around. I'm gonna show you guys some things. Just got you in the store with me. I sure need me a good pair of boots. I still haven't found the boots that I was visualizing for my birthday. The um the thigh boots. Can't find those nowhere. If anybody know where I can get some thigh boots from, can you please comment below? Hey, hey. Mm -hmm. shoes in here too. Yeah, I am a makeup junkie. I'm gonna be able to vlog and have too many people in here. It's too crowded. This is a um, liquid glow highlighter. That ain't bad. How much is it? $4.99. I might get this. I done came in here to go shopping for the boys and now I'm over here in this makeup area. Mark Jacobs. I love me some Becca, y'all. What is this? Oh, it's a mist set and refresh powder. I like NARS too. They don't open this and took it, honey. What is this? Oh, this is a bronzing powder palette. Palette. That's $16.99. I ain't, I ain't trying to spend that much in here. Not for no makeup, because I ain't coming here anyway for myself. I came here for the kids with the boys. They don't open up all these folks stuff in here. Who is that? Yeah, I got me some lashes. These lashes at Walmart and that um this is the kind that I use, but these at they have these at Target in Walmart. They be like $10.99, $13.99. You can't beat that three ninety nine. But let me get from over here in this um makeup. I supposed to be here for the boys, not for me. A 
and I'm uh, fascinated with eyelashes. I love me some eyelashes. I put them in my living room like if I was in the house. I have one in each corner. I can't too much vlog in here because I don't want to invade folks' privacy. That's cute. I will get both of them. So she can have one in each corner of her room. That's pretty. That butterfly mirror. Pictures at Panani. This is so unique. It's one ninety nine ninety nine. I wonder if it's um fourteen karat gold leaves. That's cute. So you guys, I am back. <clears throat> I'm just getting out of Marshalls. I had picked up a couple of things for the boys. Oh, and like I said, it's just hard for me. It's hard shopping for them. I don't know what it is. Like, I don't know. But I wish I could have vlogged more in the store. But a lot, it's kind of crowded in there. And today is Sunday. And you know, people, this day relax day. And they doing Christmas shopping and stuff like that. So... I really too much didn't really um, record in there because I didn't want to invade nobody's privacy. You know, some people don't want to be on camera. You know, and they be, you know how some folks are, honey. But anyway, so um, now I'm finna head to go get some gas because I am um, completely eating. Get some gas and then stop by Kroger's and I'm headed home, y'all. Y'all, thank y'all for watching my video. I appreciate y'all that's hanging in there with me. The oldies and the new. And the, well, how can I say the oldies and the goodies? Nope. That's somebody else um, saying. The oldies and the newbies. 
that's my saying now y'all the oldies thank you for watching all my oldies to all my oldies i thank you and to all my newbies i thank you as well and thank you for watching my channel and i'm out of breath because i'm so sick of this on my face is like it's suffocating me now like i feel suffocated in the stores like closed in i don't like to feel that um claustrophobic feeling yeah but anyway y'all so i just want to thank the oldies and the newbies for supporting me and watching my videos help your girl get to a meal a milli a milli 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 a million subscribers child i done jumped i done jumped before my time y'all i done i done jumped the gun i done i, I ain't even out of the thousand subscribers yet i'm almost there though but shoot i'm speaking in faith that i have a million subscribers and a, a million views okay but yeah y'all so thank y'all for watching and i'm gonna see you guys in another video peace out to the middle peace